Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I've got another Poundland haul for you all. I sort of made a, just a last minute decision this morning just to go straight from the school run. I didn't actually realise how well my first Poundland video would go. Um, it doesn't have like thousands of views, but I mean it has like 800 and something. So I just want to thank every single one of you for watching. Um, I, like I said, I didn't think it would, would well I didn't even anticipate how many views I would get in like four days. It's crazy. Um, I've got a few little bits, but there's also some Halloween stuff, which I'm so excited about because I love Halloween. Anyway, let's get into the haul. The first product I picked up was this oil bottle. It ran up at 50p at the till, so I thought, bargain. Um, I would like to get a plain one for my um, washing up liquid, but I can't seem to find a plain one because the other one had something else on it and I can't remember what it said, but it, this is oil and there was another one that said something else and I would just really like a plain one because I've seen some of the, the Dollar Tree hauls on YouTube. Um, obviously we haven't got a Dollar Tree here, but they've got plain ones and I'm desperate for one. So if anyone knows where I can get one for like a quid or something, please let me know down in the comments because I absolutely really really want one <laughs> second thing i picked up was this radox kids um bath and body wash this is for my little one he will like the fact that he's got his own because he likes to use um his other mums um, because she uses links and stuff and he absolutely loves loves that and i think he gets quite proud that he's using her stuff but i thought he needs a kid's one you know he's still only six and his skin is quite sensitive so um i picked up one of these and he's gonna love it because it's got the cars on it i also found what i went in there for the other day and it's these measuring cups and spoons they had them in like this egg egg um egg duck blue color a gray color like a beige color but i thought i'm just gonna get this color because i you know i love this sort of color and um they had quite a few, but on Saturday they didn't, so I'm not sure if it's because they didn't have any out or because they didn't have a delivery, who knows, but I picked some of these up. One of these, um, the cake glass stands. Um, when I went in there again a few days ago, they only had one on the shelf, and today they only had one on the shelf again, so obviously <laughs> I took that one. But I don't understand why they've only got one out on the shelf. But maybe, I don't know if there's a rule or something, I'm not sure. But I picked one of these up and this will be for Kate. It's because the other one I got a few days ago was for my hand soap and my um, washing up liquid to go on the side of my sink. And it looks quite nice there actually. But this one will definitely be for a cake. I picked up Ruben some toothpaste because he need, he's running out. I also pick up some toothpaste for me. I also bought some shampoo and conditioner and from last from the first bag i just got some dish matic refills for my little um dish wand thing that i use and i do think that this you can get two for a pound elsewhere but i just picked them up because i saw them and i needed them i don't have any left so i got these last bag um i picked up two packs of these spider webs um, we are going to decorate outside of our house this year because last year we were uh, just about to move we've got a bush outside our living room window and i'm just going to put these over it it's just basically you know like the pretend spider web stuff and it's got 12 spiders in ruben will freak because ruben hates spiders but <laughs> i think it'll look really nice and to go along with that i got some of these 20 orange led string lights they're battery operated they need two double eight batteries and for a pound i'm going to put them outside um underneath uh the spider web stuff just to try and make it look a little bit like spooky our front room living rooms are quite big our middle pane is huge so i picked up three of these lazy tablecloths now what i plan to do is stick them we'll cut them to size and then stick them on the actual window so it sort of makes it look a little bit spooky i guess um so i thought well i'll get three just in case i have enough if i don't have enough i can always go and get some more i picked up some caution tape it's got um i think this is a keep out one I'm not quite sure what it says. Oh, zombie. Zombie keep out. Zombies keep out. This one is uh, haunted. Do not enter. And then this one is, I think this might say enter if you dare. I'm not quite sure, but um, I'm going to put these on my front door. And then my last purchase for the video is 
I got three LED candles and I thought, there we go. And it just flickered and I'm gonna put these in my um, living room window inside um, behind the lacy tablecloth stuff that I bought. And I thought that was really good for, for a quid. But the only thing is, um, the glitter is coming off everywhere. So if you do get them, just beware. Okay, that's the end of my Poundland haul. I hope you enjoyed the few bits that I got. Please give me a thumbs up if you did so I know to do another one. I'm thinking of doing like monthly ones. So like payday, sort of weekend, I probably will go out and just have a, a nosy. But I also need to find a better Poundland because again, our one's dinky and small, doesn't really have a lot of stock. If you know where I can get one of those oil bottles from that doesn't is plain, I just want a plain one, please comment down below. And also, if you haven't subscribed already, please consider subscribing before you leave. I would love to have you here, um, a part of my YouTube family and my YouTube journey. And I'll see you all again next time. Bye!